I think the whole issue of climate change is so fundamental to whatever is going to happen in the world in the future that we need to see how it links up with every area of activity within an economic system. And that's precisely what we're trying to do. Of course, it's not easy to come to grips with what needs to be done, but I think it's becoming increasingly obvious that while we're planning for the short-term future, we shouldn't lose sight of what's going to be required in the long-term distant future. Because if you look at, for instance, energy investments, these are things that have an economic life of 30 to 40 years. And what's going to happen 10 years from now will be very different from what we have today. And therefore, these investments will have to be made clearly keeping in mind how things are going to change in the future, how the world is going to change in the future. So essentially, that's the kind of direction that we are going to be able to evolve from the discussions that are taking place over here. And these will make a fundamental difference to every economic activity and every natural resource, whether it's water, it's, uh, of course, the climate in terms of precipitation levels, heat waves, floods, droughts, all of which is so critical to defining the life of human society and all living species.